Hi, John Prendergast here. We're going to do a short, just five minute long mindfulness practice focusing in on the soles of our feet. So just follow along and do your best. If you lose your attention or your mind wanders, that's 100% fine. Just bring your attention back when you notice. So let's begin by gently closing our eyes and tuning in to the soles of our feet. Simply being aware of the sensations that are present, noticing what we can feel. And allowing your mind to notice the specific feelings, not a vague sense of our feet, but we'll tune in on the sole of our left foot and just become aware of where the most pressure is down on the sole of that left foot. Tuning into it, being present with it. Maybe in your mind's eye, picturing the area that has the most weight upon it, or that feels heaviest. Noticing what size and shape it is and allowing your attention just to rest on this place. And then noticing where it feels to be the lightest area of the sole of this left foot. What area of the sole has the least pressure or feels lighter? Maybe picturing where this is, whether it's an area that's a long line on the edge or whether it's an oval or a different shape. Just getting a sense of what shape is that area? Where do you feel it and the sensation that's present in this? Simply allowing your mind to notice these specific sensations in the here and now. And any time that your mind wanders, that's fine. Just gently bring your attention back and tune in to those physical sensations. And just as we can notice the heavier and lighter areas, we might also be able to notice any area that feels warmer. Tuning in to find where is that warmest part on the sole of your left foot. Scanning along the surface of that sole and feeling that area that's warmest. Tuning into this and simply being present with it. And then also noticing where it feels to be coolest. What area, whether it's just a little cooler or noticeably cooler, feels to be the coolest part of that left sole. Tune into this area, get a sense of it, maybe picture it in your mind's eye as this makes it even easier. And just being aware of the sensations, allowing your mind to rest on the here and now. All the while just gently bringing your attention back whenever it wanders. Simply being aware of the sensations in the sole of your left foot. And then gently bringing your attention to the heel of that left sole. Perhaps imagining the edge of the sole almost like a cardboard cutout. And following along the edge of this sole in your mind's eye, feeling your way around the foot. Moving slowly and gently, tuning in to each part, feeling the sensations, warmth, coolness, heavy or light. Anything else that you feel as you gently move the attention continually on around the sole of that left foot. Going slowly, feeling each part. There's no hurry. We don't need to go any set amount of times or even the full way around. Just to feel whatever part we feel as we move along. Gently allowing your attention just to keep returning to the sole of your foot as you follow these sensations. Being aware as you move around, feeling each part. And then just gently bringing your attention to the soles of both feet, allowing yourself to become aware of the sole of the right foot as well. And noticing which foot feels to have the more pressure upon it or to be heavier as it's resting. Simply becoming aware of which sole has that pressure or that weight on it. And then perhaps noticing which feels the warmer, which is cooler. Being aware of the sensation of both feet. Noticing what you can feel. Noticing where is the coolest place across the soles of either foot. And bring your attention to this place. Simply allowing yourself to be present here and now with these sensations. And then just gently bringing your attention back to the room. And coming back to the present. 
Okay, well done. I hope you enjoyed this and found it useful. If you'd like to know more about this type of mindfulness and why I recommend it, check out the accompanying video on how we usually make mindfulness into a chore that doesn't work for us and why it's beneficial. Thanks for being with me. Hope to see you again soon. Bye.